this is where I put my feet last night inside of this bag. It's actually my DoorDash bag for pizzas. Won't be using it for that anymore, but yeah, it kept my feet nice and toasty since my truck has, or my trunk has like no insulation. It's a, a good way to keep the toes warm. This is the morning view. Nice little shot over there. Four hours and 38 minutes away from Anchorage. It's pretty crazy to look at how far we've come. Like I was literally in Florida. I drove all this northern route to California and then I drove all the way up from California to Vancouver and from Vancouver all the way here to Alaska. I'm gonna wake up Joe and see what he's thinking. Look what he saw last night, bro. I woke up at three in the morning to go pee and he saw, bro. Bro! You know, I was looking at it, and then 10 minutes later, it was like over there. Get on down! So darling, darling, stand by me. Gas station time. Do the old tap to pay. Urgh. 4.29 here. Bit more expensive than I'd like. The hub of Alaska, is that right? This place has always got them animals on the wall. That's a big old moose. Deer. A little mini Alaska puzzle. That's that's cool, isn't it? Rubber band gun. It's a pretty cool flag. Steward. I want to go to the Arctic Circle. Grab some hot water to make some oats. Honestly, if you don't, if you use the restroom and you don't touch the door, you don't touch anything in there, you don't touch, you know, you just, you just go pee without touching anything at all. What's the point of washing your hands? I know it's gross. Like, I don't, I don't touch door handles, I don't touch anything. I just, it, but, you know, sometimes I'm like, do I need to wash my hands? But I'm going to make some oatmeal with it. So we got apple, cinnamon, and original for our two flavors here. A decent amount of water here. Might, eh. Definitely spilled a little bit there. Ooh. Look at that, what are those old chunks? Huh. Wait for that to thicken up. I'll eat it. I don't know if this dude killed a moose or what is in the back of his car. Those are definitely big ol' antlers. It could just be the antlers or he could have killed a moose. Jesus Christ, look where we're headed right now. Dear Lord. Big old glacier right here. That's done melted by now, but still cool to see here. These views have been insane. Like just driving by does not do it justice. Like I, w I feel like I want to stop around every corner that we pass and just sit there. But we got to keep going, get to Anchorage, get this hot shower. Two hours away right now. Oh, finally about to take a shower. The shower's about to hit. Oh, let's go. Okay, realizing that Anchorage is homeless central and seems like a very extremely dangerous city probably not gonna even sleep anywhere near here tonight definitely need to do my laundry uh, we're gonna cook up some dogs real quick just to get something in the stummy gotta unplug all that unplug that beautiful wildflowers there i need to cook oh yeah i don't even know if that's good anymore definitely need to cook that I'm such a fool. That looks disgusting. It's because we had the glacier ice. Do you not want them? I want the beef ones. Well. Oh. No, the wood's not treated. Oh, bad. 
Alright, just uh, maybe a, well, I'll put a window cover down mm -hmm. there. Yeah. Oh my god. Automatically demonetized right there. Really? No, I'm just kidding. Open up them bad boys. You're about to stab it, weren't you? You're about to stab it into your bed. I know, and then I was like, can't do that. I've already done it there. You've already done it there. Hmm. You like stabbing things, don't you? From, from the England, UK. What can we yeah. say? Got that dog in me. Not much girth on those. That's what they all tell me. Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. F <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I got the length, but no go. <laughs> Tell the vlog what you did at Planet Fitness. I Loud am. and proud there, buddy. I didn't realize that. It was the first time in this gym and I walked into the, the female changing room and there was no one in there. So I had no opportunity to tell that I was in the female one. So so I so I went and used the bathroom, sat there for five minutes, and then I came out and there was just like girls everywhere and I was like, oh my god. I was deep in there. I mean, what Luckily you, didn't see anything. You said I'm sorry as you're walking out. Yeah, I, I, I said like, you know, sorry to this lady in case she saw me, but she just she looked kinda of weirded out. Fair enough. What wait, wait, do? tell wait, what, did you tell him you take a poop in there? No. Tell him. No, I didn't tell him. Oh, yeah, I said I sat, yeah, oh. took, a, took a message. Yeah, you came into the women's restroom and pooped. I said I used the bathroom, sat down for five minutes. Oh, okay, okay. I thought that would be I blacked out, I blacked out for a second while you're telling the story. I'm just yeah. imagining you walking into the women's restroom. I've done it before too. I've accidentally just like walked right into the women's and then like turned around immediately as soon as I didn't see the urinals. I didn't, I didn't go deep in enough to go take a poop and then walk out. That's hilarious. Yeah. The dogs are done. Looking delicious. A little bit of ketchup. For the gullet. Such a fool for you. I don't know why that song's stuck in my head. Double dog right here. I double dog dare you. This is what they say when they say double dog dare you. Mmm. Can't beat that there. Maybe we should go to Homer, Alaska. Six and a half hours later. This is like the coolest laundry machine I've ever, or laundry mat I've ever been to. Got all my laundry here. They said I just load it up at a random machine and tell them the number and they'll turn it on for me. Let's see how much these cost. 30 pound laundry machine. I can easily fit all my stuff in there. 550 for 25 minutes. That's not, that's not horrible. All right, got everything loaded up in there. Toss this bad boy in. Oop. Close it up. And then we go up to the front to pay. So apparently the cops just arrested some homeless guy that was making a ruckus over there. That was your first time seeing somebody get arrested in the U.S.? Put your hands up in real life. I just seen it in the movies. What is it? What's the safest? Like, are we in like a? If there's only one Cabela, and there's one Bass Pro. Bass Pro is okay. in Mountain View, which if there's something that says View, it doesn't have one. That is the bad part of town. Right. Um, but Cabela's in South Anchorage, if you just Google where it is, so, it's off of C Street, that's a good place to go. Okay. So when you say like most dangerous per capita, would that mean like... 100,000 per capita. Does that, does that mean like... Assault, assault, violent crime. There's more going... Is there... Would, like, would you say New York City is more dangerous or this is the most dangerous city well, in the U.S.? In New York City, there's like 10 million people stacked on top, top of each other. Ah. Or even Chicago, right? They have shootings in Chicago every weekend. But for a city of 350,000 people, right, and you have like 50 homicides, yeah. that's still a lot for Canada. We all have secondary duties. There is no full-time SWAT, right? SWAT is a secondary duty. There's no full-time crime scene. It's like an officer. Not, you know, so yes. for us, for me as a patrol officer, I've been here for 11 years, it's my job to get felony search warrants, misdemeanor warrants, felony warrants, search warrants for houses, stuff like that. If we we could be walk on detectives on any department, yeah. under so, staff, yeah, yeah. I work, uh, yep. six days a week. That's week. crazy. So you have 50 what? calls, right? There's 26 people manning the entire city right now, yeah, and increase probably 22 people. The homeless survive out here. Don't they freeze? We have probably eight hotels that the city has purchased that we as taxpayers pay 
to house the homeless. So if you see an encampment, they have the ability to stay in a building. For they, free. They just don't want to. Yeah. So since we're, you know, we're living in the car right now, can we go oh, claim no, it? No, I'm just kidding. No, I know. They're like, they're like, nope, you guys seem like you could be productive yeah. members of society. You, you, you look like you're a type of guy who likes YouTube. I do. I'm a YouTuber. This yeah. guy is a YouTuber. No way. Oh, Fellow yeah. YouTubers. What's your channel? Uh, yeah. No. Well, yeah. yeah, what's I'm your channel? Not. Do you? What do you do? Yeah, you know, donut do, operator. I'm on blast. It has nothing yeah. to do with. I'm not a YouTube I, channel. I review watches. <laughs> I don't do. Costume. You review watches? Oh, watches. Watches. You, you know, donut operator? Of course I do. Yeah, you could do some stuff like that. I could. Are I you could. allowed to do that if I you're on could. the force? Yeah, or what's your channel though? It's all things random. All things random. Yeah. I'll check it out. Yeah. How many subscribers? But that's why we've 17, done this trip. Jeez, 17,000. That's crazy. That's crazy. He's getting that. He's getting that paycheck. That's nice. <laughs> he, he's got like 300,000. Oh, really? Two million on everything else. Calm down, Ooh, calm down. I'm sorry, it's the only first time no, no. I have to do it. We'll right, get you. It, we'll... Is, it is watches or a niche. Yeah. I've right, got, so... got like 1,000, so you know, we're all. Well, we got a midpoint. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> once I leave, once I walk off, I am not a cop anymore. <laughs> I've watched hours and hours and hours of like American Thoughts. It's the first time I've ever heard in real life. Put your hands up. Yeah. I was like, what? Yeah, you're like, what's going on? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. What's like a movie. <laughs> you're like, Welcome to Anchorage. Yeah, no, seriously. Yeah, yeah guys, uh, enjoy your stay. It was really nice talking to you. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Cabela's, they're they're not gonna bother you at all. Cabela's. Cabela's. Enjoy your guys' stay. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. What are the odds we talk to the dude that has a YouTube channel? Yeah. All things oh. random. All things oh, random. The cops, the cops. Oh, imagine. <laughs> Yeah, we got a suspicious British guy and a YouTuber. Here. So now that I've paid, just come back and hit start. Machine processing. I think it's good. I'm gonna sit down and use the Wi-Fi and chill. Just went ahead and grabbed the Power Republic. I'm just gonna charge it up while I'm here. I don't know what percentage is that. Yeah, 64. So charge it up while I'm waiting and editing and chilling. These bad boys just got done washing. I responded to all the comments on my most recent YouTube video, the uh, Washington State road trip on a zero dollar budget. If you haven't seen it, go watch it. It's one of my favorite videos I've made so far, besides this Alaskan series. Double check, make sure, oh, see, that's why you double check. That's how you lose the socks, man. I'm gonna put them in 51 over here. <sighs> Smells semi-clean. Start that baby. Almost forgot the final step here. Dryer sheet. <laughs> that was perfect. Okay, getting the clothes folded up, each individual, and then I'm gonna put them in the bag and then take them out to the car. After this, I need to go to Walmart, and then I need to go back to Planet Fence to fill my water jugs. In Walmart, I'm gonna buy some ice, get some chicken legs. I still need to cook up some spaghetti because I have that meat that's been sitting in my trunk all day with no ice. I wanted to take a bit of a rest day, but it's just like nonstop, and I'm feeling dehydrated, so I need to drink some water. On the bright side, this is at 92% charge. I just saw that they actually had a water fill up station here, so I'm just gonna fill up the gallon and then put it into the, the big boy and then repeat the process until we're totally full. And then after this, heading to Walmart to grab my stuff. All right, here we are at Walmart. Let's go get this chicken. American Walmart, baby. Chicken is cheaper here. Not bad price uh, here. The addiction is back. I can't help myself. I haven't had chips in like three weeks, so we're gonna get some tortilla chips. These are the cheapest ones I could find. Two thirty-eight for fourteen ounces worth of tortilla chips. So what? Sixteen ounces is a pound, so it's right under a pound. Uh, I'm probably gonna smash all this tonight, like a champion. All right, real quick. I just remembered I could juggle, so I want to practice. One, two, three, four, five, six. When I was working at uh, Dunkin' Donuts, I was super bored, and we had like oranges or something. And I sat there and I taught myself how to juggle. I just want to get six in a row. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh. Alright, I'm done. 1955. So I just got out to the parking lot. I got my chicken. I'm seizing it up real quick before I throw it in these baggies right here. Um, I got all my stuff out of the cooler. Put the ice in the cooler. Gonna season that up. Bag it up put it all in there and then tonight we need to cook this because it's starting to look rotten and then we got the huh? all right so the cop earlier told us Cabela's is a nice safe spot to sleep 
and it does seem very nice out here there's another van lifer over there over there and over there so we're gonna park up right here and i'm cooking up a little bit got my uh, ground beef and i'm just gonna cook the rest of this spaghetti it's actually a decent amount of spaghetti i have uh, mushrooms that i'm soaking in the spaghetti sauce with a little bit of onions i chopped up an entire onion and put it in here you can see like the onion chunks so i got that sitting you know absorbing up the sauce while i'm boiling up this gonna throw the noodles in and the, yeah i've been munching on these chips too a little bit here so all the eggs are kind of everywhere but i seasoned up the chicken and then threw the chicken in here and i got the dogs right there as well let's go all right peace out Can't get that dude off the phone, bro. He'll talk to you all day. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, just like talk to him while I was sitting here cooking. And uh, Joe's over there writing his script. And yeah, about to get that skeddy in there. Mix this in there. Bon appetite. Yeah, that's kind of what the final product, that's kind of what the final product is looking like here. All the sauce and the meat is like at the bottom of the pan, so you got to keep like flipping it over and over and over again. Um, I'm going to bag it up. Bag it. Bag it up. Um, no, I'm just going to put it in these little bags right here. And then, yeah, get them microplastics in my food and then put them in the cooler to cool. That's some of the best spaghetti I've ever made. I feel like I say that every time, but I've been making spaghetti a lot recently and this is this is some bomb spaghetti. Dang, it's already 11.45, bro. God, I gotta get to sleep. I gotta eat this up, do the dishes, hit the hay. Got my car set up, my window covers put up. The temperature tonight is 50 degrees right now, we're gonna get down to 46, so not as cold as the previous night. So I should be nice and cozy. Yeah, I'm exhausted again. I've been filming these vlogs like crap. Just not into it right now because I have so much going on. I need to, uh... It's 1217 at night, I need to go to bed. I'll catch you guys in the morning. Yeah.